Here's the for real one. I'm not really one these days to reset a ton, especially when the thing is a couple hours long, but there's just some of these are like easy things that I should be getting, so. But here we go. Here's where the clicking begins. Be a f uh, all right. Ah. Oh, I better there. Okay, that's how that cutscene is supposed to go. Just throw me the rope. But if you move the mouse at all, it pulls you off of the keyboard um, controls unless you kind of go down and up again, which I'm... I guess I should probably be weary of a bit more, but... You know, the ones where it's just the top answer, you just gotta hit enter, it's kinda like, what's the point, you know? I guess that's the point. Okay. Okay. Here we go. What? That was a pretty good boat. I'm happy with that. Good pox creation, even. Lesson learned. Why do not keep the grog next to the gunpowder? Pirate 101, folks. Isn't that a line in in this actually? Pretty sure he says that at some point. Or Elaine says it maybe. Like well, at least when their boat when their bloat uh, bloat their boat floats away. Like he mentions like, oh it's a good thing I got the boat insurance or something. <laughs> yeah, it sounds familiar for some reason. See if we can't get through this cutscene relatively quick. Huh? Name's Nick, right? Uh, pirate, um, eh? Pirate, eh? It's still a pirate. It's the deep. Some even deep. say mighty. Hold on, it. look. Uh, yeah. Uh, that's the. Oh, we got the. A little slide on him too. He was like sliding up the stairs there. Brief rest of the fingers here, and we back in. Hey. Okay. And we're moving.
quit. Yeah, no, I agree with you. It is like a little bit lazy, isn't it? I think it's one of the reasons I, I've said this before, actually, I started really seriously running. Um, running this, but it, it, this kind of feels a bit empty, I feel like, sometimes. I think that's a lot, a lot of the reason. Mm, this looks promising. Come on. Oh God! Go up. Left. Yeah, that's true. This is one of that kind of the early Telltale games, right? It was like this and, and Bone, I think. I think we're the two games there. Take the second to grab the chain correctly there. Yeah, I heard a story on. Um, I'll, I'll tell it actually in between. I'm in between uh, chapters because it'll break my brain, I think. But kind of an interesting story about chapter one and kind of the creation of it. But 100% agree with you, Steve. All right, they did Back to the Future as well. I, I, uh, I've got that somewhere. It must be on my Telltale account if that is a thing that still exists. But I have beaten that one. I actually really thought that was a decent game. It was much different than what I expected it to be, but. But I, uh, I remember liking it. That was a long time ago. It was around the same time I played this for the first time. So your mileage may vary, but I remember it being pretty good. Did I do all the things that I needed to do? I think so. Yeah, I think, if I remember correctly, there were... The most infuriating part of that game was the fact that there were some things where, you know, you go visit and talk to somebody and use some stuff, um, you know, normal adventure game things, and it wouldn't work the first time on purpose. But if you did it a second time, it would work, and there was no sort of, like, I don't know, no real reasoning for that. So like imagine me giving Yoro the map there to be like your map works. But he's just like, no, it didn't. But if I give it to him again, he's like, alright, I'll look again. But like that's not logical to me. There's a whole bunch like that in in that one. Particularly in the later episodes of it. But the story was kind of interesting and stuff, and like I, I like Back to the Future, so um, that part was kind of like nice. But it had a lot of the same problems as this, where like some parts just felt a little empty, like. I don't know. But they got better at it, I guess. I mean, they changed kind of the style of the game, right? Like, Wolf Among Us and, and um, like they had the Game of Thrones game. Um, Walking Dead, obviously, is their big one, right? Those were like, were less, less like this. 
And, uh, and more just kind of like... Just uh, interactive kind of fiction, almost. More reactive than anything else, actually. My favorite Telltale... I mean, it... I like these a lot. I, I actually, now that I've played through them a bunch of times, they hold up pretty well, all things considered. I mean, they're so far removed from where the original games were, but like for what they're worth, they're pretty good. I really like Wolf Among Us, though. I think that might be my favorite Telltale. I need to do another playthrough of that, though to have a uh, legitimate uh, decision on that. Give me the alphabet cell, please. Alphabet Thank you. What do you mean? He said alphabet sale. What do you what do you want me to do here? Dude, this is so annoying that this uh, does that. I guess I need to wait, I'm like ahead of a cycle or something. Just do this quick. Kind of an annoying thing to have had to do, but... Uh, yeah, I think it felt more focused when they did that. I agree with you, Steve. Like, I don't think that these were that bad, but... I think they kind of came into their, their own when they started doing just the straight-up story-focused stuff. Although some of those games are, are a little, like... I don't know. I have to be in the mood to play that kind of game, I think. Or I feel like I'm always down to play something like Monkey Island. It's preference though, right? Yeah, I agree. I don't think they necessarily did a bad job with it, and like if they had had the real budget, this probably would have been a like really good game, I think. Hi there. Got yeah. Yeah. That's ah, Mona. And excite. Uh, we. Slam. I. Yeah. I am. Now it's with Disney. Who knows? What? That'll ever, ever, ever happen. Probably yeah. not. But. Oh dang, we had such a good, good uh, doctor situation here last time, so hopefully we can replicate that. Alright, bell me dude. Right pedal, left pedal. Okay, we need to go to the left, I believe. There, bell me. Right pedal, left pedal.
this right pedal. That was pretty good all in all. Let's see how that compares to the last run, but that felt strong. Excuse me. Yeah, it's about on pace, which is good. I'm gonna do the same thing I did last time here and go over here. I'll do the whole thing in one spot. Fix all the wind. <laughs> yeah, that's that's it. Could you imagine? That'd be awesome. Uh, So it's we'll, we'll schedule a date once we hit the actual um, the stuff there. Uh, what are we going? South, west, north. Um, yeah, one, once it once we hit the uh, thing, we'll schedule something, and that's hopefully fitting for everybody. So I would like a, a lot of people to watch it. I do need to think about sustenance during the whole thing, so that's going to end up being over five hours for sure. Oops, got stuck on the wall there. Uh -oh. <laughs> Monkey out themed snacks, perhaps? Try to make it special, somehow. <laughs> Red herring. <laughs> yeah. It's me, Garber Streetwood. Why did I? It's me, Garber Streetwood. Why did I? Pirate. Yes, 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 yes. Um. All right, let's go to the doctor. What other uh, Monkey Island snacks are there? Jawbreaker. Bubblegum. Steak flavored bubblegum. Doc? Nacho cheese, sure. Sure. <laughs> very, very old nacho cheese. <laughs> Gatorade and call it grog, yep. Nice. I should do that. That would be kind of fun to have. You know, in between um, games to have little things. Did you swallow? <laughs> yeah, man. may not eat some of these things, but it might be good to have them around, you know. <laughs> uh, but all served on an Elvis plate, of course. Milk 
milkshake. Just <laughs> meme everything. There's a bunch of them from uh, the fourth game. Like, I can just make all the Planet Threepwood dishes there. Mighty Pirate Burger or something like that. <laughs> It's made from pure evil. <laughs> I see. Ah. Hmm. Ugh. Hmm. Much better. Wonton soup actually just generally sounds good. Would be down for that. slide. I think I was just one movement ahead of where I thought I was. I think, oops, why? So now we want to go over here at the entrance to this way. I always think last minute to do the actual keyboard input for that one, but I always, I don't know, like I said, I forget. Uh, what do we need? This one... Should be good. Please. Yes, good. I right, got some time back on that. So, a lot of time on that. I think, whatever that was, seven seconds or so. That was just me starting to, to memorize the faces, I think. Take that as you will. <laughs> it's not something I was trying to do, but byproduct. Let's see if we can't get some good skips here before ah, getting to the puzzle with the wheel and all that. forget about that one. Starts with the dialogue. Captain on deck! That's what we... That's how we get to the Rock of Gelato. We need, like, a hairpin turn here. Go around this way. Shoot the cannon into the ocean. Like, directly into the water. Just need to talk to our man here. I have never played Sea of Thieves. I've seen people play it, but I have not played it myself. Enhance. What's up, Spade? Is it the run? I hope so, man. I was on the run earlier. Tragedy struck. Found a soft lock in the middle of Chapter 5. Could you wait a little longer? Not a bad first start. 
That that would have been, I think, um, an ILPB had my last run not happened, so. We'll take it. First one in the bag. You're joining at a good time, Spade. I guess you just only missed the, the beginning of the first chapter there. Okay. Let's get the, uh, the old notes for chapter two up. Let's get the actual instance of chapter two up. There we are. Need to get you guys to see chapter two. That would help. I think it's that one. Maybe. There we go. Okay. We're here. Good fun if you play with friends, got you. Yeah, it kinda seems very um kind of make your own make your own fun with it. Makes sense. <laughs> no one will play it with you, oh, Swan. If I had it, I'd play it with you. <coughs> Excuse me. What's up, Archie? Welcome, welcome. Let's get this thing started. Again. Archie, I found a, uh... Found a soft lock. In Chapter 5, by the way. I despawned the dog somehow. <laughs> so don't do that. Well, uh, have I heard? It's kind of in beta, right, Steve? Like, I think they're still kind of working, working on that one, or something. But any of those games were always fun. That was kind of like, well, like I tried out those like survival horror games for a minute. I had a bunch of friends playing it. And those games were janky, broken messes. However, they were super fun um, because, we, like I said, we make kind of our own fun. And it's like a very social, social game. We played that for a while, but. Oh, it's been out for a while now. Haven't kept track of it. Oh wait, we gotta go all the way around, don't we? Soft lock's interesting. I got a cutscene dupe in the very beginning of the game when I was getting out of the grave, and that despawns the dog, so when you go back to give him the bone, there just is no dog there. It's heartbreaking. <laughs> so be careful with that. like, wow, nice. Uh, <laughs> we split there. Okay, let's press on. I wish I could. Problem is like you're you're stuck underground, so you actually can't even do it. That was an It's just weird. I, I never I've never seen it like completely despawn before. Uh, interesting. 
Let's forget about the artifacts for a moment. The artifacts are sacred. Oh. Uh, it's excellent. Fine. <laughs> oh. What? He's got, but I can. But McGillic. Oh, we'll pick up the dog, but you gotta give him the bone first. It's no guy brush the dog, but it's, uh, you know, Franklin the dog. It's, uh, so somewhere in between, I suppose. Alright. Enjoy your transit pass. The raft! Spoon! Leave. That's where we're gonna go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Fly Monkey 2 is the best one. Look, a distraction. Alright, we gotta go to Chucky here. Chucky time. You guessed it, more jungle stuff. Lay it on thick here. Let's go. Please, sing along, everyone. Trim themselves and roam the sea. Cool. Don't know if it was intentional, but maybe a, a rapscallion reference there with something like being being thrown up there. Ooh. That's why I'm taking it as. Learned up at the library here. Have you no a hundred and one fish tricks? Here. I hate you. Can't forget the bucket here. I decided to open the oyster there. It was not something I was intending on doing, but did it anyway. I'm not gonna lose any time doing it here. I mean, maybe we'll switch a second from this to the next, like one of the later splits, I suppose. I normally do it right before going to the chuck, so. Yeah, not really. I'm trying to think if there is anything that we can bet on. Welcome back, sir. Prepare 
Onward. I I Wow. Wow. Yeah, as long as you kind of pack them together, I think you're right, Archie. I'd have to think about the, the betting bitch there, Steve. I actually don't know. Splits are all a little goofy there, so you can ignore part of this, uh, part of that gold there. So I think this is where this is supposed to be split there. Yeah, so now we're back on track, I think. That, 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 but make, I'll make it. No. Oh. Welcome back. Well, so, yeah. Probably better for me to walk towards the the well next time. It's the only second run. Just run straight west. Oh yeah, I kind of like hooked up, didn't I? A little bit. I know you can run into the coconut, which is a pain. Mind the coconut. Mind the gap. Hmm. Snipe this thing. Running tool there. Kind of nice to be able to do that. Nope. Here. Oh. Yep. Siege begins here. I lost a lot of time on that. Wow, James. Oh wait, I have to go 
this spoon, don't I? I love his big hat there, that helps. I don't know. Blind prep here. Nice. Two minute PB there. How about that? sleep anyway. Okay, just gotta get the mast fixed. Head back around. <laughs> yeah, uh, a lot. <laughs> I've done that a lot. You have to be super careful with, um, with skipping through there, as you mentioned. Like, Show. Tell 
take the, uh, take your time with it. Morning? The map, sir. Let's get set. Yes, Gybra. It's a little flash of angry Elaine there. I love that. Careful with the walk here. A little bit careful there. It's fine though. Throw. Offhand is rough though. I'm guy Elaine did I break cool. Truck. We just gotta get through this. Couple more dialogues here. A lot of funny noises these guys make. At least the monkey has the courtesy of waving to me. Nobody else. Yeah, the graph looks ridiculous. That broken split really makes it interesting. There might be another one in the, the third chapter as well, actually, that does something like that. It's either going to spike up or spike down, I'm not 100% sure. I was going to fix him, and then I realized I don't know 100% what the problem was. So, I just left him in. Keep it interesting. The graph is great when it works. Got some time. We're ahead by a little bit, which I'm really happy about. It was a good, good uh, chapter two. Now the jams. All right. Let's move to chapter three. Oh, the chapter two time. Good point. We should have a look. Twenty-one forty-seven. I actually never closed this. Number two out of curiosity. 2151 was my PB last time. So that is a, that's, yeah, that's a new PB for that one. Turned it around there. We were behind for a bit. It's nice. So we get, get the water in when I can here. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. That's the one we didn't PB on last time. Okay, three notes are up. Let's get uh, chapter three, the game, up. Goodbye. Chapter two, hardly knew ya. Let's make sure you guys can see chapter three as well. That might be helpful for things. Thanks for the GGs. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, you guys are seeing it now. Good, good, good. Let's make sure I can see all of this stuff over here. Okay. Just stretching the shoulders out here quick. Um, timer. Make sure it's set down to first aid, which is where we want it to be. <laughs> That's true. There is one lurking in the distance that maybe we can get. I don't even care if I PB on it. I just want to... Not soft lock, that'd be cool. Good point, though. I'll try not to think about it for now. Um, okay, chapter three should be good. Everything looking normal. We're gonna do it. 
I am ready. Thank you. It is... Guybr... Disease. I brush the mouth. Alrighty, let's see what we can do here. I had a very good chapter three last time, so I'm, I'm hoping we can continue the good vibes from the last one. for the barrels there. Yeah. Update for Morgan. She's good. Read the cover. Let's do this thing. What? I'm Heavens no just as I We have another good dating game as well. Hoping. Got ourselves some earwax though, folks. Every good speedrun needs one. First is the wrist, Very then the sword, then the feet. Excellent. Good. All right. It's in. Go, man. Got it. Elevate. She. Guy. Oops. Winslow angry. You're my. Yeah. Let's have a good game here. We met through work. The we. The circus. Uh, this one is Dante. I had to take me a second to think about that one. Let's no. It's ready for Gomez there. No luck on Gomez. One of the more uncommon questions and answers, strangely. I'm I'm on it looks Uh, bug eye. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Thank you. 
Talking to me. I brush three wood. He's walking That's here. And you... Here's the plan. I don't. You're... No. Here's the plan. No. We're gonna kill them all. It's literally what she says. So it's not even a joke. So from here, we need to get, uh, we're going to lose the vote. There's no way to win right now. Santino, sandbagging me as huge, though. Hate to see that. Go through here. Shouts out to Diwali. There he is. <laughs> Murray is actually really funny in this game. What's um, going on out there? Yeah, he does stuff like that. Like chats in your inventory and stuff. Don't get much of him, unfortunately, in the speedrun, but it does crack me up, that guy. Interrogate. Oak. That's the grip. Take his oak. Left. Check for check. weapons. Oak. oak in ten. Check. You got. Hey. Definitely a great character. Not enough of him in escape, I think. They put him in there, but it's a little. Go talk to Bug Guy for the face off, I believe. I hope. Come on. All right. Can... Yeah, I'm right. I'm a... Planet Threepwood Bouncer. That's kind of funny, I guess. It's our.
All right, Swally, please. Nope. Dang, past two runs I've done, he's just dropped them right away. Yes. How can I? We'll see. Just. Hey, okay, bongo time, folks. Bongo, bongo. Oogie. This really is a Zelda reskin, isn't it? We talked about that the other night. This is skipped a little too quick there. Go to painting. And it Let's do the protuberance of the odd variety. Which is what you want. Alright, so right tube should bring us back to the bar, which is where we want to go. No. Strange growth. Thank you. Here we go. The cover time. I assume a majority of that time that I lost was waiting for the uh, glasses to, to show up. And that's how you win a face up. Are you which See the vote.
Enjoy that. Okay. Let's fix this uh, manatee's ear, folks. Let's do it. We were talking about having, uh, carrying, carrying animals, but this one goes a step further. It's to be, the, the animal carries you. This one. So that's a positive. It's go time. No, not look. And I'm gonna crush you. Huh. It's one of those random ones that that wrap back around. It's really annoying. Other than that, solid though. Mutineers. Hips are ridiculous. I'll have to take a look. It is funny seeing her feet. When you pick the feet up with just the hook there, it like looks really funny. Um, because they're so like just like little sticks. I don't know if I've paid attention to the hips though. See her in a sec though. And I believe you. A lot of the proportions on people in this game are wonky. And I think that's why it's so like obvious when they reuse the character models and things. But different problem here. Let's have a good dialogue here. This one I keep messing up, so. More to do. Got it. Thank you. Off you go, bud. First, stinky cross eyed geezer. Now, deal with Murray here. Now 
Welcome, Leo. Playing D and D, enjoy. Probably you can't hear me, but welcome to Leo for me. Helen Wolf says hi. This this is kind of a weird thing. It's easy to skip through this. Um, it has the pick. So to singe. It's guy brush. Next me now. Next me now. you go. Sinji boy. Give him a wedgie. Good old hex wedgie. Let's go. Twelve easy steps later. All right. More fluent. Hex me now. I think I go in the water now. I'm not mistaken. Whoa. Mistaken. Love the callback to that theme there. That was good. All right, bud. Eat me. Said, eat me. Much appreciated. There it is. Fish here. DJ Salmon. D -d 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 DJ Salmon. Actually, probably wouldn't be a salmon. Salmon's a freshwater yeah. fish, right? The who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Oh, the friggin' stuff here. Yes. It's always an afterthought. Alright, dude. Let's do it. Let's get you, uh, get you a date. That would be satisfactory. Not bad. It'll still be better, I think, than last time. I'm still a little bit on edge, I think. Let's go get that sponge, friends. As intended, I'm sure. French toast sounds awesome, like I said. 
may uh, may look to partake in some of that myself a little bit later in the day. A little breakfast for dinner. I'm so bold. Although I do have some leftover homemade uh, General So chicken. Which is awful nice. family classic it's tried and true my friend it's a good one should be able to enjoy breakfast whenever you want I say Dinner for breakfast. I mean, you could. I would normally eat a croissant for dinner. True. That's fair. <laughs> Ooh, breakfast burrito. I love a good breakfast burrito. Mm. Those are making me hungry. I think I might have to have a, uh, a feast once this is over here. Hopefully a celebratory one. But not uh, a wallowing in my sadness. Feast. <laughs> Eat to forget. Now that I bubble and squeak. Well, and I what is bubble and squeak again? I've heard of it. I don't think I've actually had it. What's the other one? Toad in a hole or something like that? Some funny, funny names for English, English foods, UK foods. Blanc. It looks like she hits him with the, the blade, which worries me a bit, but I guess you're to assume it's the, the handle. All right, that was a really, really nice um, chapter out there. I was not expecting to get 30 seconds on that. I didn't think it was that bad. I know, honestly, that went really well. I don't really know if the time came back. Retrieve the funnel. And Connors, <laughs> hmm. you have a worse haircut. I wonder if I just ended up like splitting in a different. I don't know. I don't know how. To... I mean, we must have saved Eric the time. Parsons, all dressed up and no place to go. But definitely best credits. That guy again. <laughs> Murray. Animation. Roasting everybody. I no animation. I live. Okay. How many numbskulls? Numero quattro, folks. Big chapter four here. Um, alright, we've got Ah, Joe Pitty, the man who taught me everything I know. What? Everything I know about evil. <laughs> about evil. Got to see uh, uh, a notepad up for the in a notes. Dark room with lava lamps and they think it's heaven. Sound? I don't wanna hear it. Amy, are you with Sorry, Murray, I gotta cut you off, bud. Let's uh, make sure you guys can see it. That's monkey four. Could I be up there? Yep. All right, cool. Tales of MI. Murray percent. Oh, that would be interesting. <laughs> It'd be a little bit easier because it he only really appears in, in this episode or that episode, I should say, chapter three, right? We'd have to get all of his inventory lines plus chat with him a bunch. Once he's on, like, once he's in there, chat with him when you kind of have him captive. It'd be kind of an interesting challenge. All right. Stream is looking good. You guys can see the game. Got my notes up. 
Timer's in the right spot. Game is up for me. All right. Okay. Let's get, let's get the stretches in. All right. Okay. Let's not mess the pepper up, folks. Use the hook with the pepper. Hook with the pepper. Well, much, but... Hook the pepper, exactly. That's what we need to do. Hook that pepper. Stretch my hand out here whilst we row into port here. Little Flotsam Island. You know we're gonna go into that jungle. You know it. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Highlighted. We can't miss it now. Let's hope. I got young. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> Hook the heifer. That's gonna mess me up. Something. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Hook the heifer. Give it a pook. What? Give it a little pook. Port house. Give me the card. Let's go. The trial and execution. I brush three blue. Of Mancomb Seep Good. Shouts out to Stan. This evening for second lead. And what the I plead. Oops, just clicked outside the screen. I love that. Well, when all of Well. Well. This no. Come on. No. Didn't get the sprint there, but press that was decent. Some escape from Monkey Island vibes there. The puppets and all that. That was a little bit of a late split. Getting the right dialogue options. I hmm. I keep your little nothing. What? I hey. what you think, my dear? That's what my finger feels like after playing this game. <laughs> 
these? Alright. Puddle of Wax. That's my new band name. Puddle of Wax. Two axes, of course. So yeah, that'd be cool. Let's get an eye. What? I. Jen. You just. I'm in trouble. Hey. Alright, so far so good here. Um, we need to change the, the cat's diet here, right there. Hey! I need a little uh, BJ shuffle there. Channeling it. It's inner Ben Jordan here. The weird oozing fluid, as you do. As you do. All right. Come with me, monkey. I guess you get a couple then. So you get Franklin. And then you get uh, Jacques, the monkey as well. Rebs, aka Nacho Lady, aka Yaboa. Okay, let's do some work here. Uh, caustic fluid. Lovely, thank you so much. And this and this. Should do the trick here. You're We're moving to Hemlock after this. So you see. So you see, I've destroyed this man's glass leg, and you know that is a crime in itself. But we're gonna avoid talking about that. Pretty whiskers. Goods. Got the goods. I put just. Hey, would you look? 
Smart. Oh. The pox isn't. Your butt's Then the pox now. just is. Okay. Wonder Bunny. Serve the peppers. Don't serve the peppers. I mean, serve the papers. Then we gotta do the peppers. Serving ourselves some peppers. <laughs> serve the peppers. Crack myself up. Okay. Let's uh, let's move on here. Let's do the thing. What? Or. I'm seeing the the waste there now, and uh, I agree with you, Spade. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, Ryan Stump. Just give me a frog, dude. White stripes. Almost forgot to get the friggin' sugar there, that would have been uh, bad. Glad I sniped that, holy cow. Take your more time. Yeah, we split on the sponge. I think we've got a, a tactic now for the sponge as well, which is good. I saw what if Miss. Okay. Now be Here we go. This is where things get difficult. This is the most difficult split of the game. Right here, in my opinion. Because I tend to mess it up. Hold it. I heard Chuck, yeah? You see? Listen. I can and it was my heat. So you but it turned In these Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Shoot. I paused it for a second there, so remind me to let it run an extra second. Well, under normal you like give me the diet the men and hey neat no more listening hmm well, that's odd okay cool we got like a whole got the whole thing there which is really good okay so in here we need to um do a little bit of this are you Started to do this as well. Okay, now we're prepped. Ouch. Hmm. 
Okay, two Desinges. So where everything kind of comes together here. What an interesting fact, Mike. <laughs> Dolphins are interesting creatures, man. <laughs> Nature, man, that's the Fugu. It's the Fugu. They know. Nature, man. That's crazy. Legs left button, and now we need to be very careful. What we've got a long way to go to do one specific thing, otherwise, we lose a lot of time. Cook the pepper. Cook the pepper. Hook the pepper. There's the pepper. There's the hook. I've hooked the pepper. Okay. We did it. I know that doesn't seem hard, but I've messed that up more than I've gotten it right. Okay. Move it along, folks. To the jungle. You knew it was coming. Oh. We managed to get the uh, the folds early as well, which is kind of difficult to do, in my opinion. I got first try folds, if you will. That folding, um, the first time you look at the map with the voodoo lady. <laughs> get wrecked, Pepper. Exactly. Okay, good. What? Okay, uh, lights with moth. From the papa. Back here. We now need to go to the well. After, of course, some fun cutscenes. Pretty violent with the sound there, right? Holy moly. Okay, this is why we needed to get that sugar. We need to dump it in right here. Jungle. Otherwise, we lose a, another good bit of time. Let's dip one of our legs in here. See if we get the fun uh, glitch here. We did. Love it. Love it. Proper J. Woofs the third. Nobody hooks a pepper. Uh, um, I think this is the left again. Getting thrown off here. 
thought that was the up, but I gotta go west, west, north. That's my bad. Gotta trust the process. The mic. Here, boy. Don't. After this, we need to go to Stan. Okay. It's probably what those dolphins see with the toxin there, huh? Sweet, sweet puffer fish. Kind of disappointing. We really don't screw over Stan at all. We beat him in court, I guess, but it's really not like as bad as locking him in a coffin for, you know, months, right? Kind of disappointed. I guess you don't really do anything in the fourth one either, do you? I feel like that's out of character. You always have to screw him over somehow. I guess he doesn't do anything in the first. Maybe I'm just maybe I just like the fact that in uh, in the second one, you really you really do do him in. Maybe I'm just a mean guy. Uh, here we go. Yep. Aw. Pepper. Arrow card. The walk. Off you go, bud. Supercharged. All right. Okay. A couple more spots here can be a little bit weird, but I we think we're going to be okay. Guybrush, don't do it. Don't do it, Guybrush. Ah, oh, you did it. You know, did the thing. <clears throat> don't worry. For three. What? Hey. Oh no, no. First of See you in the next chapter, there, bud. All right, sugar in the water. Pepper to the face. That's gotta be so painful, by the way. Way to go. A round of applause for Desinge, my goodness. Three. 
Feed him the sponge. Shred of he did, I guess. You're right. Gave it everything he had. He's a pretty good bad guy, honestly. Easy to root against. Goofy. I mean, until this moment, this is, you know, giving LeChuck a run for his money here. Well, that's pretty bad. I don't know if you can get worse than killing Guybrush, but... Oh, come now. Pretty wild ending to this, is all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Crazy. Crazy, man. Um, oh, I'm gonna let this run for one second here because I paused. So there you go. Finger slipped at the in there. You can retime what that was. Add another second on for for good, good, good spirits, good, uh, good will, good will hunting. All right. That's number four. One left here. So this is where um, where things can go really south here, as we found out. Um, let's all let's all hope that Franklin shows up. This is the this is my ask for the game. All right, let's get the notes up here. Stretch the shoulder out briefly. <laughs> Have a sippy sip. <laughs> Archie knows what I'm talking about. Yeah, that last bit is rough, and it's easy to, to miss those like moments. That's why I like I'm really vocal while I go through it, because otherwise um, I have a high chance of messing it up. But if I talk myself through it, it's been okay so far. All right, bye bye, chapter four. Hardly knew ya. Let's get this up on the screen for you so you can watch what I'm doing. Franklin, please. Franklin, please. Let's uh, get rid of that. All right. Like the end of two or the roller coaster in three, but a touch more annoying. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, the kind of the, uh, the, the beginning of two. Definitely, it's like doing the laps. At least you have a little bit more control over moving, though. That's the thing. If you could could just say, like, do something to make LeChuck move, it would, wouldn't be as bad. But because you just have to sit there, it stinks. There's a few parts, right? Because even when you die and you're just kind of... Or you're not dead, but I guess you're in jail and you're waiting to die in the jail. Weird sentence. Um, you have to just sit there and wait after you read the Bug Eyes uh, journal and stuff. It's a weird one. And then you play as Elaine for the next chapter. That would be awesome. That would be a pretty cool change up to, to what was going on. Or if they did sort of a split thing, maybe Elaine does something to to bring back Guybrush or something. But would have been neat. It is what it is, though. I like this fifth chapter casually, though. I will say that. It's not as fun to speedrun, per se, but it is what it is. All right. Um, you guys are seeing what I'm seeing. Timer's ready. I've got my notes for five up. I think we're good to go here. Let's close this thing out, folks. Franklin, please. Franklin, please. Be so careful here. The rise of the pirate marathon. <laughs> sure feels that way, man. Yo, Robin. What's up, dude? Hope you're well. Happy Sunday. Shows you how long I've been streaming, my goodness. Ooh. Show me Guybrush. Alright, we're good. 
on that one. That's uh, so what happened before is that duped. So we never actually exited the grave and then we just warped here. So at first I was quite excited. I was like, wow, I think this was faster actually. Little did I know. Little did I know. That was just where my troubles were beginning. What? What? He's got... Dollar dollar bills, y'all. Okay. Okay. We have the change. We've got the meats. Here you Please enter the... Hmm, that's a good question. I went out and back. I did not try doing that, though. That's a really good point. I probably could have saved to that. Uh. I'll see if I can dupe it again. Not right now, but if it ever happens again, that would be interesting because it's possible that maybe with an autosave and then reloading, that would be faster because you do kind of just warp to the front but there's no real I don't I haven't timed anything it just was my gut my guts off the wrong when it comes to times at least but certainly in the uh in the frame of of doing all of these over the course of a couple hours here what? would be better to do that than to I just restarted the fifth one and just went through it Time for treasure. Time for treasure. All you can dig. Careful with the way that the uh, camera works there. You get the pile of treasure sometimes. Can you What's funny is I still managed to PB with that happening, which is... I guess it, that makes sense because I screwed up the fourth chapter so bad last night. But... Do it again, you're right. Gateway? Said gateway, right? Thanks. Tip jar. Hey. Be careful with that. I've gotten on the boat a couple times there. Get our grog. Great. Franklin, please. Franklin. It's Franklin. There he is. So this is the part on the last run where hey boy. Franklin just was not there. Just disappeared. <laughs> grog XD. High energy grog. <laughs> There's the time save. What? Yeah. Yo, what's up, Gromek? The thief. Yeah, early one today. I started around noon my time. So it was uh, up and at him today. Where are we going? Crossroads. Take my money. Take my money what? again. Are you I don't think I got my thing, did I? What? He just... What? Don't worry. Huh? Yep, yeah, did not get it. It's I all good. 
fact, it's Frazier. Oh my goodness. Yikes. Uh... Oh wait, I didn't do the sock yet. Good scratch though. Good scratch, scratch percent. you go that split is for real that was uh me resetting the fifth chapter after the the dog did not show up so that is actually 100 percent real Oh my. Yeah, it's a good one. That was the one I was waiting for. Good news is we got on a pretty good run outside of that as well. So this was all pretty nice. What? Hey. What? I'm Eves. <laughs> Hello, friend. What up? No. See anything over here? Oh. Okay. Are you sure you meant behind me? Oh. Okay, back to the treasure. Tips. <laughs> See ya. There. Okay. <laughs> Parrots out here. It's me. It's your boy. I brush three point. Oh. All right, do your thing, man. Do your thing, dude. Okay, we gotta go back to the crossroads, get that prepped. Then we're off to some sword fighting. What? And Yeah, the parrot thing is, is funny, isn't it? They really committed to that that some gag, and it worked out, I thought. Rock. I goofed up a little bit of the sword fighting last time, so a little bit of time to probably be saved here. Whole bunch of cutscenes to skip first, though. Sword out of your dome. Okay. Let's do it, Morgan. Let's dance. That should be good to go. I thought the graph looked silly before. Look at it now. My goodness. I actually just looked at that. Get your sleds out, as Mike said. Hey. First part of the that Yeah. Which warp us there. Perfect. Right. 
Parachute, yeah, parachute's probably more appropriate. That is a, a cliff wall that we just went down. <laughs> Too dangerous for a sled, probably. Let's rest the hand here a little bit. I got some time there. That was the uh, the sword fighting, I think. Let's get ready for this dialogue here. Sort of like satisfied head bob there. Love that. You, you, why did so, you, so you admit I am better than you. The Buddha, why the, the voodoo lady. But I mm, this way isn't mm. Alright folks, we need to get ourselves a cutlass. Kicked out of the mortal realm. Just another Sunday, if you ask me. And yet. So, sweetheart, where do you. That's. Should be good on that. And now. From here, we need to head to Gateway. Nice, thanks, Groban. Even uh, 10k there on the uh, total total donates. I'm... Much, much appreciated. Got to be what? around 70% now, I think. Might have broken 70 here. We're getting there. I'm not running out of time here. Running out of time in terms of... Uh, it says 70? Cool. Okay, cool. I should say I don't have much time left to learn these things because we're getting awful close now. Thanks, Archie. Yeah, man, it's coming it's together on. here. It's coming really? together. Yep. Oh, cool. So I well, still got a bit of run left though, so Gotta embrace the uh, embrace the I'm not running around here. Should be in a good spot to jump right in the water. That's what we want. Mr. Yes? Did he... yeah. Alright, we need to uh, talk to an enemy, right? Hello? This was monkey too, that diagonal would have been fire. Mr. Yes. What? Well. Sweet diag, bro. Thanks, dude. That's what happens when you play too much, uh much monkey too you see that diagonal you're like oh that would have been nice if it were on a uh you know 
know, a 2D game instead of a 3D game and some stuff. Dozens of frames, yeah. Spade appreciates it. You know what I'm talking about. Sweet, sweet diagonal. <laughs> Get you over there. Right, we should be good to go. Holy. Have to be so careful when doing I... that. When... Oh. Let... Miss... Yeah. Push the button, Max. Oh no, this won't work. That's right. Very good. Very good, sir. Now push the button. We need to surrender. 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 We need to go to jail. That's all I can sing for people's sanity and also to not get the channel muted. Anyway. Yeah. Alright, bud. One of our waiting uh, moments. Cheers, folks. Just gotta wait to die. That's pretty much what we're all doing, right? I brush speed running life right now. Uh -oh. Run in here, folks. Pretty sure we're heading to a sword fight, looks like it. But first, we have to get through these crabs. That'd be two hours, folks. The two hour mark. You, you must fit. A lot of better spot than last time we hit the two hour mark. My goodness. Two big ones, yeah man. Double the hours, double the fun. Yo! I don't- I'm gonna- Stinky tweaking meanie. Arr. I let's just oh. 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 shot. And you <laughs> Ooh. Back to the gateway again. Low net. Okay. Now for the longer split. Don't ask me why I did it this way, but this is how I'm doing it. In we go. Thank you. Uh, push Mr. the button, dude. So we're looking for the mug on this visit here. I sur Surrender. Got there before we got the uh oh. 
which is kind of nice. Uh, and we did. You know. Alright, we need to get ourselves some root beer. It's everybody's favorite root beer. Mine is Saranac. Saranac root beer. It's a New York brewery. Does some good craft beer as well, but they make a very, very good root beer as well. Hi there. Favorite root beer out here? You can't get that, um, like much root beer, out in here in the UK. But the one that I have uh, enjoyed so far is one that's uh, by Soda Folk. Is the name of it? It is kind of a funny drink. Yeah, it's a weird one. Boylan's. I think I've had Boylan's before. Yeah. That's a good one. Henry Weinhards. I've never heard of that one. I'll have to put it on the list. Mr. Win I love me a good root beer. Barks has bite though, you're right. Pentamins, I don't know. I think Barks might be the best one of like kind of the, I guess what you'd call big name brands in the US, right? a and is the other big one, I guess. Oh. I'll have to look at the Pentamins thing though. But yeah, if you're looking for one in the UK that, that um, has the thumbs right. up from uh, an American for what it's worth. Soda folk. Good one. You can get it on Amazon even. Mug. Oh yeah, mug. Grab a mug. AW is trash and can suck it. Very nice. United against the cause. to go get ourselves some deodorant, folks. American. The rest of their soda, not so good. They have a cream soda, a grape soda, and a cherry soda. The cherry soda I'll mess with, but the grape is probably the worst grape soda I've ever had. It kind of tastes like cough medicine. And the cream soda, it's just, uh, yeah, it's not very Listen up. good. But the root beer. Go for the root beer. Sun-kissed grape soda is very good, in my opinion. There's a lot of people who don't like grape soda, so I feel like I'm in the minority of people who like grape soda. Fanta has an okay one as well. In the US, it's much different out here in the UK. But. It's something that my yeah, the monkey alley community is toxic about. <laughs> Root beer. Split down the, the row there. Spade, you like grape soda? Awesome. Welcome aboard, grape soda gang. It's true. Everyone should, I guess, if you're a fan of monkey alley, have, have some sort of opinion on root beer, I suppose. I don't know. It is fitting, right? Where are we going now? Treasure. Back to treasure. Oh, 
Oh yeah, yeah we are under there, aren't we? Is that walking? Let's go movement. Movement tech. Yeah, orange versus grape, hundred percent in the same, uh, same, uh, same boat. The amount of orange soda that I've consumed in my life is, is shocking. Boy, big fan. Yeah. Big on sun kissed on that one as well. Orange soda out here is very different as well. I do miss that. Yeah, so you've got the the US connection there. The soda folk stuff. Alright, we got that belt buckle. Okay, over to the thieves now. Sounds nice, whatever that is. I actually do have um, some thoughts on orange soda as well. They so they don't have the same kind of thing yeah. as orange soda out here, but I did find a really awesome um, East London brewery uh, that does um, soda. Good luck. Is this a sword fight again? Yeah. Hold, um, what are they called? Square Root. And they have a, uh, a couple of different orange soda. Oops. Orange sodas. Um, one of which, if you're looking to check it out, um, is called Orange Crush, I believe is the, the name of it. And it's a little less, I guess, like soda-y. It's more of kind of like a, f a fruit drink, but... Um, are we good here? Blindfolds? Or, oh, we have to surrender. Glad I checked. Hey. Oh. I yeah, Square Root is the name of the, the company, and they, uh... Hmm. Not sure how far they're... I think they might have them in, like, Sainsbury's or something like that, too. I, your mileage may vary, because I know they're here in, in London, but I don't know how far that reaches, right? But they're really, really good. Different kind of uh, thing. Raspberry ginger ale. Ooh. Schweppes. Or Schweppes. Where? Schweppes. I had a joke at my job where everyone started calling it Schweppes. We're good here, right? Alright, let's put you on a diet. So the blindfold is first. Like a, like a good neighbor, State Farm is here. You are. The small feather, a secret friend. Your what? The do for the bo. Fight. And finally, our magic here gum here. Home stretch here, folks. Fights on the rails, but we gotta make sure we don't forget anything. As Archie mentioned earlier, it's easy to do. There's a bunch of different Schweppes that, um, for ginger ale that are kind of like, taste different. They might have moved those into just being kind of seltzers, as opposed to being the ginger ales. I don't know. It's something to look into. Backhand. Always taken aback by the back. Just gotta get through this. Eventually, we end up where we need to be. Stretching the back out, stretching the shoulder out while we uh, get through these final cutscenes. 
Thanks everybody for hanging out, by the way. It's a doozy of a run here. Oops, clicked outside the screen. Stretching too much, I think. Hook. It's the main sail. Uh, okay. Back the truck, please. Please. Good, good laugh, LeChuck. Need that. Yeah, we should have the keys here somewhere. Yoink. Okay. Finish the keel hall here. We then need to go all the way back around to where we were. Use the keys on that, um, that thing on the right you can see there. So there's a bit of waiting in here now. Tim Curry as LeChuck. Well, a bit of a change up. I mean, he already has the adventure game kind of connection, right? Because he was uh, Gabriel Knight in the original version of it, right? Yeah, I hope I hope we'll be sub 220. I hope so, but we'll see. So unfortunately, I can't use the main sail again to go right down. Otherwise, this would be easy. We just gotta wait for this dingus down there to decide to jump up and say hello to me. Superhero jump. Yeah, he's in the original uh, version, not the remaster. He was Gabriel Knight. Funny, right? Because I didn't know that till recently when I uh, started playing through them. Or playing through the first one, I should say. I have no idea if he has done it on the second one or third one, but definitely is the one on the one I'm playing right now, which is so weird. Wouldn't have been my go-to guy, I feel like, but it's uh, an interesting one. You haven't played any of the, the Gabriel Knight ones. They're pretty good. Well, th this one's pretty good. It's a little bit dated, um, but it is, uh, it's been a kind of an enjoyable story so far. But since it's a Sierra game, it's a little bit tricky. A lot of dead ends and all that, that noise. Um, all right, we need to go back up. The wife from King of Queens is Gabriel's assistant. Really? That I didn't know. Jeez, that's a star-studded cast. King of Queens. Kevin James is the narrator. He's not the narrator. Could you imagine? That would change the tone of that game. Uh, in a, in a hundred, you know, 360 degrees. I guess it'd be 180. Not so much so that it would be uh, back to normal again. I had no idea though, that's pretty cool. Okay, home stretch here, folks. Fettuccine Bros. Shouts out, shouts out. Pretty glad that this is almost done. My hand is uh, struggling right now. No. In fact, I'm gonna do the old switcheroo here for the ending. Got a little bit of time here before we need to bust out the ring. <laughs> now that's a game right there. Now that is a game. <laughs> right, here we go. Ring. Bam. Two seventeen twenty-five. Sacrifice. My arm is Place tired. These things in My arm is tired. But I'm at the really happy the with that time. Roads. I'm good with that ah, for now. Lever. Wow. What a rush! Hey, my hand is back! 
Oh, have a drink of water here, I'll tell you that. Is? Wait, you were expecting me? But I was dead. Is that why you gave me? You should know enough to trust me by now, Guybrush. Thanks for the GGs, what? everybody. You asked Much Chuck appreciated. To demon bride. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How did you know I would be able to bring you back from that? That was a really good run. All these years and all I was expecting the drop, certain. like, you know, the but five I or six. Well, it was probably like, actually, I don't even know how much it was. Always come for me when I need him most. I guess it was around five and a half minutes. That was your master plan? You have more faith in me than I thought. I was expecting well, that. No, but we did manage to get, gone. like, what was it, 30 oh, to 45 God, seconds in the early, and the earlier ones as well. So this ended up being a really, really nice, um, and that's what this really nice run. Sponja Grande thing has been about, huh? 